Now a CBS2 exclusive this morning. We're hearing from the mother of a young man killed by police in the northern suburbs. The shooting happened while officers responded to a 911 call of that man beating his family members with a sledgehammer. CBS2's Hassal Rasai has a breakdown of what led up to the shooting. Police say that suspect was shot after charging at officers with a sledgehammer multiple times. Take a look at this video. This is right outside of that chaotic scene around 3 o'clock yesterday afternoon on the 2000 block of Redwood Drive in Round Lake Beach. Officers able to get the two victims, the mother and the aunt of the suspect, outside to an ambulance before they say he lunged at them multiple times. Officers first deploying a taser before shooting that suspect. He was taken to a hospital where he later died. The mother speaking with CBS 2. We won't show her as she was bleeding and badly injured. She says her son Brandon Barry was only 22 years old. And that's my son and I loved him very much. And now I don't know what to do. They could have shot him in his leg. They could have shot him in his arm. They didn't have to shout. Put three bullets in his heart. Police say the suspect is known to officers and the home has a history of domestic related calls. They say their investigation continues this morning. Reporting in the Streetside Studio, Asal Rezai, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Asal.